This is the Blue Temple. It was created by the apprentice of the artist that created the White Temple. So this was created kind of like in homage to the White Temple. The statues at the Blue Temple were just absolutely incredible. The detail in these was phenomenal. I thought it was really cool to see that this temple would provide people with a free sarong to borrow if they weren't covered up enough. Most temples will try and sell you one. This temple, they'll give you one to borrow as long as you return it. Another awesome thing about the Blue Temple is you're allowed to film inside it. Please remove your shoes and place them on the shoe stand before entering the hall to pay. Respect to the Pucha Invest. The intricate artwork and detailing inside this temple was amazing to see.
This temple had a bit of a mythological feel to it with some of the characters and statues around the place. They were also detailed. Check out this three-headed elephant. And this statue was just amazing. It would have been about three metres tall. Just to the side of the Blue Temple is a bunch of little shops and amongst those shops are a couple of smoothie stands. It is well worth getting a nice cold fruit smoothie to cool down from the heat. These incredible massive statues are located right at the entrance to the car park for the Blue Temple.
After spending a good amount of time at the Blue Temple, it was now time to go back to our hotel, relax on up, have a swim and get a feed. For those curious, this is what our hotel room looks like. It cost us about $40 a night. In Thailand, it's well worth making sure your hotel either has a pool or is located near water or that you have a bath in your room. It gets incredibly hot, so water is so refreshing and needed. Time to get into some dry clothes and head on down to dinner. This hotel we are staying at is called Mario Resort. That's Mario with a Y instead of the I. I highly recommend checking them out if you're in the Chiang Rai area. They made incredible meals. It was such a nice resort. There wasn't many people. It was such a peaceful vibe. Definitely a cool place to stay if you're in Chiang Rai. Thank you for watching our videos. If you enjoyed, please like the video and be sure to subscribe to our channel.